What's going on YouTube? It's your boy Cool Cool because we are back and we're doing something different because we are at the Staples Center. Um, I don't even know what kind of video I'm going to make for you guys. But, but yeah, we're at the Staples Center. Let's look around. I haven't been at the Staples Center in years, many, many years. And these are the best seats I've ever got at the Staples Center too. So yeah, let's, let's go take a look at the seats and let's look around. And I'm going to talk about like the deals, man, because the deals are crazy right now. For tickets so if you're always scared of covid great time to watch a lake game i swear this is my favorite part of coming to the stadium right here it's a, my favorite favorite part oh man this is it right here this is it right here man all right man get your big old head out of here out the way. first time i've seen this arena in so long Oh my god, this is so dope, dude. Man. We're looking for seats five, so let's see. Row five, then we got seats five and six. Seats five and six. This is dope, this is dope. So this is, what is it? Section 107, row five, seat five and seat six. So this is freaking dope. This is the, definitely the closest I've ever been. This is at the wide angle too. I guess this is at the regular angle. It actually looks a lot better too. They're not shooting around? They don't do shoot around? 30 minutes early? What the hell? Like, are they already done with shoot around? No. They still got the USC band? Do they still have them? I didn't know the USC band. Is that a USC band still? It was like 15 years ago, so I don't know. I haven't been to a game in so long. They do have the Team LA mini store, but I'm trying to mess up the mini store. All right, we're still looking for the main, main Team LA store. That's what I'm trying to show y'all. This is kind of why I did come. Let's go check out the Team LA store, all the gear. Tons and tons of merch. Oh man. Yeah, they don't have any sneakers here, but they do have plenty of Lakers merch as well as uh, all the other teams that do play here. Let's let's see what they got. Damn, I haven't been here in years. They got an art area. That's freaking dope. Look at all the dope art. Do have a bunch of autograph memorabilia and stuff. It does say no photography, so I'm gonna go too deep in there. That is dope though. That's dope. And they got signed basketballs and stuff. You know, you're not gonna get no fugazis and stuff here. You know, you're gonna get legit stuff. AD, 1500, six Gs. Damn, I actually seven Gs, my bad, for the LeBron. Oh, the Shack Attack. The Shack Attacks. That's the original Shack Attack, go for 1900. And then a Shack, Shack Ball, only go for six bills? That's a bargain compared to the other ones. Magic and Kareem both go for six bills too. Man, those are bargains. <laughs> That's freaking dope. Is that the old floor right there? Is that the old floor? 27K, dude. 27K. Those are all the names on there, man. Pretty much a Hall of Fame list right there. And yeah, that's that price tag right there. Man. Now right, let's check out some of the apparel. It's a jacket right here. They have special tags too. They have like, oh, the Lakers original tags and it has a Lakers store. That's dope, that's dope. 65. Yeah, I'm not paying 65 for that. But that's not bad. Not bad. Ooh, Lakers 75th anniversary. Sweatshirt. This is pretty dope. 70 bones for these. Obviously, we're going to see a lot of retail price here. 70 bones. Dope. This is for women, right? Guys ain't wearing this, are they? $28? All right, that's dope for women. That's way too short for guys. I don't know. Am I allowed to say that? I don't know. <laughs> and then. Uh, is this a women's shirt? I don't know, 45 bucks. Oh, this jacket is fire. Pro Standard always makes really, really dope stuff. All this stuff is not cheap though. 100 bucks, 100 bucks for these? Whoa, it's a really thin jacket, but that's not bad at all, dude. This is a double X, oh, triple XL. Maybe it's on sale, cause that's actually a hell of a price, holy crap. 50 bucks for this shirt. Yeah, that's a dope t-shirt. I'm not, I'm not paying 50 bucks for this. is dope. This is dope. Hey, it's kind of like... Catch a cold. 70 bucks, what? Yeah, it's a catch a cold. Catch a cold, huh? Oh, is, is it? I was like, what the hell are you talking about? But that's dope, dude. So this is the one that you got? My boy Edward's telling me. He got this at the NBA store. The Lakers, what, the Lakers store shop? The Lakers storefront at the... Let's go, and he got that for what, 10 bucks? Okay. Dang, it's going for $40. He got it for $10. Damn, I fell asleep on those. I'd wear that for 10 bucks. I'm feeling these Pro Standard t-shirts. Like, I love, I have one of their hats. Their hats are just ridiculous. 
but but the price tag 50 bucks but this shirt is so fire dude has an emblem on the side that's just fire dude that's fire more pro st I, see i didn't know they had that much pro standard stuff here that's dope because i really like that brand just way too pricey 70 dollars for these shorts these shorts are fire though look at all the emblems right there man then more of these t-shirts we got sweatshirts sweatshirts going for 100 bucks okay does have that embroidery stuff on it dang that, that's not crazy because all that stuff has the same material as this and i only paid 30 dollars for this at the outlets dang clearance center baby more pro standard stuff like damn dude they got so much fire stuff 70 dollars am i paying 70 bucks for this yeah no i'm definitely not dude I'm just not balling enough for this place, yo. They do got the Westbrook jerseys, you know, and they got the, I think this is the only place where you can actually get one with the the sponsorship right here, right? That does have the BB Go jersey. This is Nike, a buck 20 for those. Yeah, like I said, I haven't seen that anywhere. And I think that's the only place with those. Got the Howard jersey, and nobody buys these, right? Mitchell and S. 350 for these these is fire extra fire oh my god like like at least six six flame emojis right at least six flame emojis. these are dope too these are fire these are go for 120 the davis jerseys and yeah, the mlps one just funny that one oh that has the wish one from last year okay tht jersey right here has the wish one that must be from last year. Okay, okay. Backpacks. That's some. This is a Herschel company. What these going for? These go for eighty-five. These go for seventy-five right here. Sixty-five for these dry fits. Go for dang it. Oh man, I almost dropped them. Okay, this, this, the material's nice. I'm like a lot, but sixty-five dollars. Good load. Good load. And then they do have a bunch of the Mitchell and that stuff. We've seen ton of these at chic not going to see these shorts these shorts are fire though but yeah still go for that premium price tag a buck 50 for these 135 for those then the leopard ones go for 100 shack jersey this is the one with the leopard print on it these mugs going for 150 right here okay 170 for these this is like a jersey material one I've never seen that. I've never seen that 170 for those. And is this like a baseball? Baseball, just a 120 for these? Oh, I've never seen that. It's a Mitchell and Ness right there, okay. And then Laker Polos. Laker Polos, I don't know, this is like Ecotech? What the heck? Ecotech, that's the technology they use. I don't see a price tag on it. All right, but that's about it, guys. That's about it. Let's go take a look at some of more of the Staples Center. Plenty of Lakers gear. I thought they had, I guess they switched it all up depending on the event i thought they had some hockey stuff and some clipper stuff but i guess not even while even while you walk out they do have memorabilia man kobe look at that limited edition only eight exist down to down i said down dude that thing's going for 24 crayon and look at this one only eight exist freaking 38 grand dude 38 freaking grand holy crap you're like pretty much buying art it's like buying art memorabilia like that's just crazy dude all right let's go check out the seats and stuff of course it's a little thirsty now i gotta get some beer oh they have a little beer garden type of thing right here i've never seen that oh i haven't gotten to a game in so long okay but yeah we're gonna grab, grab our beers and then we'll go to our seats dang it the bud light one has a line the montejo and the other ones no lines dang it Dang, full year old ass still getting ID'd for. Oh, that's your real beer? Yeah, that full still yeah, getting ID'd. Uh, 36, 70. 36, okay, 36 for pretty much for four beers. Four beers. Yeah, now we're good. Got some Bud. I'll drink almost any beer, but I'll drink some Bud. But yeah, this is like one of the few that they have like that are huge. All right, let's go back to our seats. And that's a little mini Team LA store. All right, this is this is my favorite thing. Hey, he's gonna mess it up. Yeah, my favorite part. Oh, well, there's too many people. My favorite part, dude. My favorite part of coming to the game. Man, this is fire. I love coming to the games. Oh my goodness. Northwest Division of the Western Conference. Woo! Let's go, baby. Let's go. And the whole team. 
your Los Angeles Lakers. Woo! And now tonight's presentation. This is empty as hell in here. What the? Halftime score, Lakers is up, man, they up. Let's get it going, you guys. Go Lakers. God, Westbrook just lost it. How did he lose it? What the hell? Oh my God. This, this game is so close, so good. Lakers need to pull through though. Come on now. Uh oh, three point game, three point game. Oh, damn. Damn, damn, damn. Graham took the L, fools. We took the L. All right, time to go, time to go. Alright Eddie, the sad, sad drive home. Dang it. Dang it. Alright, let's go home. Let's talk about it, man. Let's talk about this. It's fun. Fun stuff. Damn, I forgot to show what I'm wearing. Holy crap. I'm wearing these bad boys. Kobe Pro Tro ones. These are the noise canceling. Whatever. Then Nike Lakers hoodie I do have. I have a jersey underneath. Kobe jersey, authentic jersey. Alright man, let's go, dude. It's depressing. Let's go. All right, guys, that was the Team LA store as well as the uh, Staples Center. Something a little different. Definitely something a little different for the channel. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, man, they got a bunch of dope merch in there. The prices ain't low, though. The prices ain't low, and and I normally don't pay retail for, uh, for apparel and stuff like that. So, um, yeah, back to the Nike outlets for Laker deals because... Man, the prices were high as hell. But like I said, the merch was super, super fire. Um, yeah, definitely worth the stop. If you guys are comfortable with being with crowds and stuff like that, uh, definitely, definitely, definitely a great time to check out Laker games right now. Also a great time to check out Clipper games. Clipper games are actually even cheaper, but the seats that I ended up getting, section 100, which is on the lower section, row five, I ended up paying, what, $100 plus fees? I think it was like 117 or something like that. Man, it's super, super cheap. Uh, definitely gonna be hitting up at least two or three more games. Um, I don't know if it's because people are uncomfortable with crowds. I don't know if people are uh, concentrating on football. I don't I don't really know. But I have a feeling that the seats will go up, especially as the season progresses, especially as the Lakers record hopefully gets better. But yeah, I definitely do think that the price will go up. So I'm gonna try to hit up a few games before the end of the year. Just because I'm cheap and I'm always looking for bargains because, uh, yeah, that's what this channel's about, right? That's what this channel's about, looking for bargains, stuff like that. I think this was the cheapest game of the season. I haven't seen any other games where the lower section is under 100 bucks. So, um, yeah, I'm definitely going to have to keep searching. Um, it might be the fact that, hey, this Thunder team was just really bad. Or it might be the fact that... I bought the tickets within a week. I don't know. So I'm gonna continue to monitor that see how that goes If you guys are Clipper fans or if you guys just like NBA like Clipper games are almost free right now Like almost almost free. I'm actually checking out uh, the tickets for I think Tuesday's Portland game Clippers versus Portland I, Like I said the tickets are almost free. I think the lower sections under like 30 bucks uh, the section 200 which is uh, the middle section that's under 20 bucks I might just go there just to root for Damon Lillard and, and McCullough I don't know so we'll see what happens because 
Man, it, it sure is fun going and when you save the money and you don't pay full price, it's even better. Yeah, thanks so much for joining you guys. Thanks so much for watching. Let me know what you guys think of this video in the comment section. Definitely something different. Um, hope you guys enjoy it. But yeah, make sure you help boy out. Make sure you press that like button. If you're new to the channel, go ahead, press that subscribe button. Click on that notification bell. Plenty of videos coming. This was the second video of the day. We'll have um, other days where I do have second videos. I still want to make a video about the new flex system. There's plenty of changes on flex. And um, yeah, I got some sneakers to review too. So yeah, make sure you guys stay tuned. Turn your notification bells on. And yeah, see you guys next one. Peace.